Greetings fellow humans, Bad Mark here with another transmission from Mac Tech Keyboards. And today we're taking a real quick look at a new switch. Um, this one is from Flaming Skull and it's called the Ice Blue Tactile. Now I've never heard of Flaming Skull, uh, but Boy on Amazon started carrying them and um, he offered to send me out a set so that I could do a review on them. And I said, sure, why not? So first, the specs. This is a tactile switch. It's a, I would call it a medium tactile, as it's kind of heavy at the top, but then it kind of starts easing off as it goes down to the bottom. So it's definitely not heavy. It's more of a medium because of that drop off, in my opinion. Um, it is made of a PC top housing, a PA66 bottom housing, as well as a palm stem. Um, it has a 20 millimeter single, single stage spring. It bottoms out at 55 grams of force and has 3.5 millimeters of total travel. Now, the switches have no ping. That's discernible, though there's very, very little indication of, of lubrication, but it does seem to be lubricated just in the lightest amount. So these uh, ice blue tactile switches are available on Amazon from Boyu's store for $13.99 or $14 for a box of 35, which makes them basically 40 cents a switch. Now, they're quite poppy. They lean more towards the clacky side. So if you're looking for something clacky for your build, I think this would be the switch for it. Um, it's funny, both my wife and I said the same thing about it. It's fun. Um, this is the kind of switch, instead of a clicky, that I would put in, say, one of those fidget spinner key rings where you can, well, or actually even, say, one of these, where you could put it in and then and just go to town. It's quite loud, um, so... I don't think it's going to be something that you're going to be wanting to use in an office environment, but it definitely has a nice sharp bottom out. Um, it's like a capital D. The entire press is, is the bump. Um, and then you can feel it about halfway up coming up. Now it has the slightest of wobble north to south as well as east to west, but it's extremely minimal. Um, as you can see, it is a long pull stem. And also of note is that it has a 3.5 millimeter travel. So even if the case, which does look to be upgraded, but it's not gonna have any interference with cherry key caps because, that, because the stem is not going all the way down. So if you guys have any questions or comments about the switch or would like me to compare it um, to any other switches, please do let me know. I am going to leave you guys with a stock sound test of the Ice Blue. This is in a Red Dragon Draconic Pro K530 Pro. Um, it's been modded. Uh, I did a silicone pour in here. Uh, I also did the PE foam mod, and it's been it's been a, fun, a, a great board for testing different switches and getting an idea for them because it definitely just amplifies the sound the way that it's built um really amplifies the sound of any switch especially a long pull switch so i'll leave you guys with this with the sound test 